Hey, Tony here. Today I'm going to show you all the titles I picked up during the month of January, so stick around. So we had five weeks during the month of January. We are just coming out of the Christmas season. Um, so not as much spending during the month of January, but there were a lot of great titles released. So I'm going to take time today to show you what all I picked up during the month of January. Uh, first up, for the first week of January, we got Black Adam. I did get the Steelbook Edition. I really like that. I got the Target Exclusive. I got the 4K release with this really nice matte finish um, slipcover. And I got the Blu-ray release because of the different artwork. I really enjoyed Black Adam. I thought it was a fun movie. So very happy to have that in the collection. Um, I got the 4K release for Pray for the Devil, which I have not checked out yet. Then we had some um, quite a few Disney releases. We got Mickey and Minnie um, 10 Classic Shorts, Volume 1. Beauty and the Beast. Toy Story. The Little Mermaid. Frozen, Moana, and Zootopia. So that was from the first week in January. The second week, I got She Said, Fear the Walking Dead. This right here is the complete seventh season. The Friendship Game. We got Friday the 13th, the final chapter, still book release. We got Groundhog Day, still book release on 4K. And I also got Dragons Forever. Um, this right here, I believe, was from 88 Films. It's a hard box set. And then during the third week, we got um, Detective Night Redemption, part of a trilogy. We got Double Jeopardy on 4K from um, the Paramount Presents line. We got The Menu on Blu-ray, really great film. And then from Kendall Lorber, I got Messing in Action 3, 2, and 1. There's also a box set for that collection. Um, I got Program to Kill, Ghost Warrior, No Mercy. We got the Cloverfield Still Book, which is a great film. And we also got the um, still book 4K release for They Live. That was during the third week. During the fourth week, we got Violent Night. Fun film. I hear they're going to do a sequel. I got this film from Shout um, G Kids. I got Taurus. Death Wish 4K release. The Last American Virgin. Men at Work, Belly 4K release with this really nice slip, and we also got a really nice looking still book release. We got The Dentist, and then from Eureka, I got my order for Royal Warriors, and for Run Man Run. And we also got the release of London, which I watched, which was an okay film, a lot of dialogue. Okay, during the fifth week, I got my Back to the Future um, 4K Steelbook from Zavi UK. I also got the Mondo Steelbook release for Civil War. We have the Crimes of the Future 4K release. Event Horizon 4K release with a slip. Great film. Dawn of the Dead from Screen Factory 4K release. The Asphinx. The Italian Job 4K release. The Lady from Shanghai. The Grand Master of Kung Fu. We have Season 2 of Magret. Attack of the Beast Creatures from Vinegar Syndrome. And I got the three, um, the four film collection with these four films featuring Peter Falk 
added to the collection. So those are all of my pickups during the month of January. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you think about my pickups. And also let me know which of these you were able to pick up. I really do enjoy reading your comments. If you like what you saw here today, please give it a thumbs up and share the video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. If you do subscribe, please remember to hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video. If you haven't found me on my social media accounts, I'm on Instagram, TikTok, and on Twitter. And if you'd like to find out what I've been watching, you can find me over on Letterboxd. I do have links below. But thanks again for watching, and we will see you next time.